it has been said that a lot of young men are converted to Islam and is a case study. People are wondering why millions of young men are converting to Islam, are accepting Islam, are becoming Muslims. So let's hear Sam Ari's point of view. Have you been keeping abreast or have you noticed this trend that's happened of Westerners choosing to convert to Islam in adult life? Obviously, mm. you spent a lot of your mm. career criticizing Islam, and right. now we have, I don't want to accuse it of LARPing. These people very well right. may truly believe in the doctrine, but I mean, Andrew Tate Andrew is, Tate, yeah. is, is yeah. one of them. And, and downstream from that, mm. there's on-street interviews with young British youths with mm. these um, Islamic scholars or, or, or imams or whatever, uh, mm. converting them on the street. And they're, right. they're like yeah. they're doing, the, doing the thing. On the on the street, yeah. have you have you? I haven't I haven't seen those vox pop conversions, but um, I saw Andrew Tate's conversion. Um, well, I mean, Islam is just mimetically, it's perfect for a, a specific audience. You know, it's um, it's it's a explicitly macho religion, right? It's a no pussies religion, right? It's just a and it's, it's just, you know, it's a, uh, like, w w with Christianity, you have to pretend... All pussies? To, yeah, well, you have to pretend to be happy to be losing for the longest time, and you're basically just waiting for Jesus to come back and rectify this gr grave injustice. Like, you're, the meek shall inherit the earth. You're just, you know, it's, there's no putting this place right. We're not going to win until we really until we see you know Jesus arrive on cloud trailing clouds of glory. Um, so it's it's all going to be fucked up for the longest time, and there's no imperative that we really do anything. Really, like there's no expectation that we are going to win before anything good happens. I mean, I guess there, there's there's one Christian sect where they do have an expectation of of. Uh, of kind of winning, you know, a thousand a thousand years of of, of millennial glory until and, and and then Jesus comes. But for most Christians, it's just it's it's a story of failure, and then they get to say, "Look, we were right." Mm -hmm. You know, Jesus. You know, Eat shit came back. Yeah, yeah. With Islam, there's an expectation that they're going to conquer the world, right? And there's an imperative to conquer the world. And for ser for serious Muslims, it's like you, know, you don't have to be impatient necessarily. You can take as long as you want, but. This is all, we all know this is moving in one direction and you need to be a spiritual warrior. And if you, if you take this really far, if you become a jihadist, right, you're an especially doctrinaire, militant, you know, true believer. Well, then you're a kind of spiritual James Bond. I mean, then it's like, it's like you get to be Jocko and care about and know that you're going to go to paradise, hmm. right? Like, so you get all the tools. Like it's, it's, it's the, it's the first person shooter that literally you get all the good guns. Like it's not, it's not this boring. I'm pretending to just, uh, you know, I'll, I'll turn the other cheek, you know, hit, you know, thank, thank you, sir. Can I have another? Um, and you know, where the, it's, it, it's, it's a high T religion. Right. And that's why a schmuck like Andrew Tate thinks it's, he's had an, mm. you know, a real insight people in embracing seeing, it. People are seeing it as a redress to, women of the West who uh, have been conned by feminism into believing that mm -hmm. these things are good for them, they're not good for them, we need, you know, no one's happy, look at the divorce rates, look at the 60% uh. of US teenage girls aged 12 to 16 have regular or persistent feelings of hopelessness. Yeah, yeah. Everyone's only fans pathologically fapping themselves into a, a early monster energy hole or whatever it is that they're doing right the answer is a return to something that's got a bit yeah. more lindy nature to it yeah well i mean that that's the claim that i want to deny i mean it, it's it's explicitly retrograde i mean it is regressive it is backward looking it is not uh, it is not using all of the good ideas we've, we've had in the meantime right it's like it's a disavowal of the present and the near present. I mean, the modernity. In in the case of Islam, it's a dis it's a disavowal of nearly fourteen hundred years of of wisdom and insight. Right? It's it's a it's a claim that in the seventh century, 
somebody was so smart and so wise and so prescient and so had, so had his shit together that everything worth thinking about and talking about happened then, right? So we should con confine ourselves to the products of that conversation. That's just, I mean, it's, it's imbecilic on its face, right? And it's not to say, again, it's not to say there's nothing useful to come out of Islam, but whatever is useful, we can use without believing that Muhammad was visited by the Archangel Gabriel and got and you know got the last you know download from the creator of the universe um, it's just not this is not to deny any of the cultural problems that someone like Andrew Tate or I mean there's lots of people we've we've dragged into the conversation here but like all of these people who I've criticized to some degree Tate or RFK or or um, I mean you could add Elon to this. I mean, all these people are kind of living out the consequences of their dissatisfaction with the present on the public stage and winning a lot of followers as a result. They just like they I, I you know they like the way these guys are complaining about the obvious excesses of the left for the most part. Man. <laughs> No matter how one wants to, you know, explain the reasons behind young men converting to Islam, it's not, it's not easy to explain. Like, it's, it's a personal decision. That's what me I'll say. Them conversing is is due to their experience, what they encountered through Islam, and their personal decision made them convert. You know, even with some Aris. He's also finding it difficult to give, like, it's very hard to give the reason. He's trying to explain, you know, give example, oh, Andrew Tate is just minding Andrew Tate. These people that are converting Andrew Tate, I think, you know, the Pentacy and other people converting online, you know, all of them gave their reasons for converting. Some they encountered a lot, some they said because um, Islam, because of the way that they, 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 they relate with people, you know, is a tolerant religion, is a religion that show, you know, um, kindness, you know, all those kind of things. So even some Aries is even his explanation, I'm not really getting the reasons why. It I don't know, his explanation is too deep. I, I, I needed something that was quite straightforward and easy. And say, okay, it's because of this, it's because of this. It spoke about Muhammad, spoke about what the Islam is all about, why people are converted to Islam, because Islam, you know, you know, Islam is a religion of peace, is this, and you know, I was expecting something much more simple, like straightforward and simple answer, not something deep. You get it. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.